Okay, guys, so this is what I've been working on. Uh, I've been working on this painting for, for a while now. So I'm just, I'm just going to, sorry about that. I'm, I'm, I'm holding my phone and trying to work at the same time. So I just want to show you guys a few, a few of my techniques. Since I'm working from home and I don't want to make my wall dirty, I just, just took me a board put a board and then I uh, said I don't you know sometimes when I work I, I, I splatter and all that so I just want to make sure that I, I only work on this part so sometimes I also use my hands uh, in some areas like I would probably just take paint and you know just do this it's it, it, it contributes to the texture of the paintings you, you don't necessarily have to use only uh, brushes um for myself in particular i work extensively with um pallet knives so it's my pallet knives and that's that's what makes my strokes unique i have my own strokes that i use pallet knife with and they help me to develop the 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 uh my te my technique so i use pallet knife and mostly you know these kind of brushes the ones that are that are flat and those contribute a lot to towards the success of a wonderful painting so this is me i just work mostly with strokes i don't really i see here i already signed it sometimes like the great picasso once said says you don't finish a painting you just stop working on it i don't know is it picasso or or da vinci one of the two said that <laughs> So yeah, uh, you don't really finish a painting. You just stop working on it. And on this one, I had signed it, but I haven't stopped working on it. I'm not done with it. I still feel there's a few areas here and there that I just need to add a bit of detail. So this is my work, and this is how I do my work. So this is this goes to people who want to try um, lots of contemporary art. You just need to know your strokes. Just need to know mine i've i've taken a long time to cultivate this you know to be able to to do strokes in such a way that i'm not afraid whether they're careless or not but i just do them regardless so it's you know you you can practice let's say i want to do an eye quickly it's just a matter of stroking i i dip my brush again so it's a matter of stroking, but obviously you will definitely need a bit of knowledge of the, the um, tonal variations, you know, uh, um, texture, and and the likes. So in proportions as well, very important. So you cannot adequately do a perfect eye, for example, if you do not have the a knowledge a single knowledge of those things so you need to practice every day like i was saying in my previous video that you just need to to be in a habit of practicing every single day make sure you don't you don't skip a day if you do just make up for it so yeah i'm just showing you an eye and how in my case it works it works like this this is the eye See already it's 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 beginning to show. And all this is just done without sketching because now I'm new to my technique, right? I, I know what to do, how to do it. It's my technique at the end of the day. And but for someone who's who's still learning, you might need to, you know, um you might need to make sure that you sketch first. Otherwise it's gonna come out ugly <laughs> and we don't want ugly art. We want beautiful art. Nobody wants to see ugly art. Even uh, abstract art is not ugly. It's still beautiful. So it's a matter of, you know, so, you see, um, doing my eye, and my lashes here. I won't necessarily do the eyebrows, but I'll just show you because the intention here is just to show you how it's done with using strokes. So all this is just, you know, random, uh, careless, not, not really careless, but confident uh, brush, stroke, brush strokes so we create order through cares 
understand and this 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 is very important for someone to understand that you you need to do everything well and perfect so uh if maybe i'm to add another color i don't want to use white because uh i just don't feel like using white <laughs> so i'll just use this yellow instead and there we go you have yourself an eye so it just works like that you just need to get yourself used to know to doing to know what you're doing and i hope this is going to benefit everyone um this is my new piece that i just just been working on i've another piece that I, I need to finish just right there i finished that one some time ago so yeah uh cheers guys stay safe and enjoy thanks tabi so yeah oh i guess yeah i'm not gonna show my face today <laughs>